Okay, inside 57. <clears throat> the very moment that physical pleasure is gone, the pleasure feeling loses its grip on the mind, and the mind reverts back to its prior state of defining things. At this moment, the only pleasurable grip left to influence the mind is through memory of a sexual reality, such as the recent memory of the pleasure experienced. However, there is no prominent grip on the mind. One might find it puzzling how one got into the sexual state of mind just a second ago, and how that point of view suddenly magically disappeared. Release from the pleasure of the genitals is the key to freeing the pleasurable grip on the mind. The mind focused greatly on pleasure, sees, or defines, others as possible suppliers of pleasure. The memory of the individual still remembers that a few moment, moments ago, a different reality was being experienced. This person might voluntarily choose to re-experience the lustful perspective. In parentheses, as explained in insight number three and four. Yeah, so what remains right after the pleasure is over? The pleasure is gone, lost its grip of the mind. Now only the memory remains. Just a second ago, I was in such pleasure. Hmm. A different perspective. Now I have this perspective. Very interesting. You, you remember that you were in a different perspective. And some, like I said before, they, they may want to go back and re-experience that. The lustful perspective. Often happens to some people, they wait a, wait a while until the, the male genital organ uh, is able to regain its uh, strength and re-experience pleasure, then they go into it again, which is possible. Memory of the individual still remembers that a few moment, moments ago, a different reality was being experienced. This person might voluntarily choose to re-experience the lustful perspective, as explained in insight number three and four. So one believes a lustful view is the correct view, the correct perspective, and therefore when he experiences a momentary uh, ex perspective of sober, the sober perspective, he defines that as false, and he wants to voluntarily, he goes back voluntarily to, to um, thinking in a lustful way, because he believes the lustful way of thinking at, looking at things is the truth. Another person, more advanced, says, recognizes that the sober view of looking at people is the real way of looking at people, meaning is the correct perspective, but because he's not aware of the pleasures involved in there, He's not really entirely sure of where the pleasure really lies in that. Um, meaning, uh, where, is the, where is the pleasure in this? They're not aware of it. And so therefore, because they want to experience pleasure, they want to be in the state of experiencing pleasure, they go back to the lustful view to experience that. <clears throat>